Mzansi. The dirty linen of under fire Zulu King Mrs. Zulu Gazuelitini was hung out in court by family members as part of a conceited effort to ridicule and drive him off the throne. Yikes, Mzansi. Hey, hey, Mzansi. Hello and welcome to Entertainment News, Mzansi. If you're new to my channel, you know you're here for the stories, go ahead, click the subscribe button and of course the bell and you'll never miss an update. Now, this is according to Royal Insiders, Mzansi, who said voices calling for his head have grown louder. At the court, of the campaign as the bid to stop his coronation at all costs and should this fail to undermine him as a king. Now this is part of a campaign to, frus to frustrate the king hoping that the pressure will be unbearable and he will voluntarily stand down. The only person who's protecting the throne right now is Shange, Prince Mangosu Tubutelezi. The king made a big mistake when he publicly showed his frustration about what was happening in the royal house. By doing so, he was playing into the hands of Prince Mbonisi, Gapegu Zulu and his group, said the insider, who is not authorized to speak to the media. The insider was referring to an incident where Gazulitini was addressing a gathering organized by his charity organization, the King Misuzulu Foundation, where he was uh, donating food parcels to Devon flood victims. During his address, mainly in Isizulu, he raised his grave concern on the shenanigans playing out in the royal house, saying his own flesh and blood had made him their sworn enemy and wanted him dethroned. By Hoko Krokum Zanzi. He called on the Zulu people to defend the throne because they knew who their rightful king was. The source further said Mrs. Zulu's de detractors were opportunistically using the known problem of the king's battle with alcohol as a railing point. Another insider said the so called royal dissidents have held several meetings where they hatched a pushback strategy which will ensure that Mrs. Zulu doesn't have peace on the throne. The aim of these meetings is to hatch a strategy to undermine the reigning king. The plan was also to convince Amabuto to side with Prince Mbonisi in his pursuit of dethroning the king. They were disappointed when Amabuto refused to support their campaign, said the source. Now, it was also established in Zanzi that Mrs. Zulu's foes are waiting patiently for Prince Butelezi to depart so that they can take him on. They accused Butelezi of shielding Mrs. Zulu. In the Pretoria High Court matter, Prince Mbonisi, who is the brother of Mrs. Zulu's father, the late king, Zulitsui Nigapeg Zulu accuses his brother's son of being a drunk who is not fit to be a king. The main application by Mbonisi and 12 other royal family members in an attempt to nullify the decision by President Cyril Ramaphosa to recognize Mrs. Zulu as king. Now, the aim of the meeting was to hatch a strategy to undermine the king. Yikes, Mzansi. So, Mzansi. The late king's brother is taking on the late king's son. So it's basically uncle versus nephew, all because of a throne. Mzansi Yikes, who needs enemies? Do leave your thoughts in the comment section. You know I love to hear from you. But for now, you know, I will bring you the updates hot just the way you like it.